So, when... First of all, welcome everybody. This is Fred Duff and uh, my bride, the Joy's in the other room. We're here from Richmond, Virginia tonight. I'm about as excited as I've ever been about this particular Zoom for a couple of reasons. Tonight we get to feature our veterans who've uh, made it possible for a guy like me to make an extraordinary living in this world, in this country. We appreciate your service, male and female. Oh, my goodness, we appreciate you. And, uh, you know, and this, this Zoom tonight is going to feature how this product and our companies help them with their health, not that we're making any health claims, but how it's helped them with their wealth. It's going to be exciting. Like you, this is the Zoom of the year, as far as I'm concerned. So let me turn it over to the host who's going to be running through the slides. He's also one of our great veterans. He's a Marine, and we love him. His name is Ty Rowland, all the way from, well, I think he's in Charlotte tonight, but the, who knows where he's from right now. He's he's definitely from Florida, but we're happy to have him. We're happy to hear his great story, and he's going to run this Zoom, and we'll be playing tag. So everybody, if you could mute your phones, we'll get after it. Yeah, so Fred, we want to welcome everybody tonight. It's going to be an amazing 30 minutes. And if you are out there tonight and you do have interest in having another stream of income into your life, a home-based business, or as we call it in today's world, a global virtual franchise that you can work anywhere you're at from your phone, your iPad, your computer, whatever your favorite mechanism is, and, and be able to work that business all around the world. The name of the company we're going to show you how to do that with tonight is called Partner.co. And Partner.co has been in business since February of this year. We are operating in 58 countries around the world with official license. And what we do as a company is we create, manufacture, and then deliver to the marketplace, the end consumer, some of the highest quality nutritional products that exist on planet Earth. Everything from hormonal balancing to skincare to energy drinks to weight loss. All of our products are all doctor created. They're all backed by science. We either have done or referenced over 215 published papers. And because of that, a number of our products have gotten into the physician desk reference, about a dozen now, meaning that our products are going to be at your doctor's office right when you show up there uh, for whatever you go to the doctor for. This business allows anyone, I, I was a Marine, but I was also a high school football coach, and it allowed us with four children to, to create a secondary stream of income that really took some pressure off. But we have found through time that we have a lot of veterans that get involved with this. Uh, Nikki is one of the top earners in our company. Her husband, that is her son there in the picture, and that is her brother in the other picture. They own a business together, but, but Nikki is what I call a network marketing baby. She inherited a business from her dad, her and her brother both did, that he built. And Nikki said one of the most powerful things to me a few days ago in Salt Lake City. And Nikki, I'm not going to steal your thunder, but your husband was a career officer in the Navy, um, was last on a huge aircraft carrier, but just retired. Will you share y'all's journey and your impactful statement about your dad being able to leave you in a, uh, a business and then him not being able to leave his retirement to his kids? Yes. Hi, everyone. I just wanted to say thank you so much. And I'm so honored to be with you. So my husband just retired from 33 years of active duty service. He started off enlisted and then he rose into the ranks of officer and he retired as a full commander. So to me, that was super exciting. But the part that I really wish that I got when I was an active duty spouse is network marketing is a portable career. It's portable. So if you start to think about everybody that you know that is in the that's in the military space as far as a spouse, look where they can reach. Globally, you can go everywhere because remember, think of this. The bases all have USPS, right? So to me, that's so incredible. That means you can take your global business and reach all of these places. Now, let's go back just a couple, eh, to about seven, eight years. So we inherited our father's business. We're a family of strong entrepreneurs. He had a tire shop, my father did. Then he started off with network marketing. 
Then he rose and he kept going to different companies. He found one that he loved. He passed away. We inherited his business. Now, with that being said, that went to my brother and myself, as you can see on the picture. But here's the kicker. And I want to get, and I wrote down some notes because I want to be very factual when I say this. Military retirement pay stops upon death of the retiree. So unless you have an SBP, which is survivor benefit plan. Now that is something that my husband has for me. What that means is when he passes, half of his retirement will go to me, but zero will go to his children. Did you get that? That's so powerful because I started to think when 33 years of a career, none of that is transferred, that legacy is, tr is transferred to his children, except for the greatness that their father did. Mm -hmm. But guess what it is? The business that I have is transferred to our children and to my brother's children. So that's where I want to say, you have to be very intentional with your goals, be a very direct communicator of what you want and your tribe will find you. So right now, that's for me is the military spouses. Wow. Nikki, you're you're awesome. amazing. <laughs> wow. And, and thank you for your services as a, as a, as a um, officer wife for 35 years. That's not an easy thing. That's not an easy task moving around the world, but thank you guys. And thank you for sharing, you know, how this home-based business can apply into y'all's life. And it really, it's almost cheating because you guys do move around the world so much. You've got so many different friends in so many different countries. It's just a um, great, great business to do as a um, officer active duty wife or as uh, anybody retired from the military. And speaking of that, Andrew and Melissa, Andrew, you're um, mighty young in that picture, but you're now retired from the Marines. we got to represent the Marines. These Navy people try to, the Army people try to take over. But Andrew, tell us a little about yours and Melissa's journey here with this home-based business. And you will have to unmute, uh, Andrew. Okay. Uh, that's what I'm trying. I'm, I'm Okay. I'm in there now. I'm having a little technical difficulties. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Good evening and thanks everybody uh, for having me tonight and let me speak. As Todd was saying, I'm a 30, 30 year career Marine. And with, with my retirement is that our retirement doesn't pass on. It doesn't go on to the wife or the, or the kids. And when it, we're using this as a side hustle to have a legacy so we can leave a legacy for our kids. It, so they, they, the kids and the grandkids we'll have something that once we pass on because our retirement doesn't, um, it, 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 just, it just doesn't keep pace. But with our side hustle, our, our side hustle keep pace with inflation. And that way we have more to, more time, freedom, and more money to invest, invest in, in, into the future of our kids with our side hustle and our grandkids and our future great grandkids. And it, it just, and Andrew, you and, you and Melissa just worked this on social media and Zooms right from your home in your retirement. Just grandkids in the lap over at the house. You just kind of build it in part time into your schedule. Yes. Yeah. That, we, we just do it. Um, we do it on the house, do it at the house. And on and sometimes when we're on the road uh, traveling from different places, we still work it. it. It's a global business. So you, you can work it anywhere, anytime that you decide you're ready to do it. You know, you're not tied to a desk like a tr traditional job. And we're going to see Rashawn in just a second. I know you signed up Rashawn in um, South Mississippi, but Rashawn is now taking your business over to the UAE. I know y'all got business now over there. Yes. Yeah. We got a team that's getting um, getting started over there with uh, Dr. Alondra at the um Cosimo, she's at the at the helm over there, and she's helping break, helping us break new grounds over there. Well, Andrew, we're going to mention three quick products, but the first one is our weight loss product, and you and Melissa have had a great journey there too. How much weight have you guys lost? Uh, we've we've lost 160 pounds together. Is the um we've been, but our journey has been 
uh, cooked over about two years now. And we've, we've been able to keep the weight off and do we do, I'm, I'm a lot more flexible, getting, getting better, getting in better shape. Uh, the wife is doing the same thing. So we, we just, it, it just, it's a, it's a journey and we just enjoying the journey of being on the, being on a health, a health trip that's uh, with, with these products. Well, congratulations, 160 pounds, nothing to, to sneeze about. You can write home about that one. A lot of weight. I've got to feel tremendously better. So, so this is our signature weight loss product here. We call it Slenderize. It comes with two bottles and a direction booklet when you get it from the company. One of the bottles is full of plant leaves that bring the thyroid into balance. They, they balance out blood sugar levels. They, um, they stimulate detoxification. The second bottle is full of B12, ashwagandha, rhodiola. And they do everything from slightly raising metabolism. B12 has a ton of clinical research showing its ability to really help in high stress a high anxiety environments. Um, so a lot of people get just a really good feeling from taking them. I think we uh, got a lot of women now that call them their happy drops because they just feel so much happier when they're on them. But we have a clinical study that ran in women that took the drops and followed the program that comes in the book with what we call our approved food list. These women lost about a half a pound a day over the first 28 days and the men lost three quarters of a pound a day. So um, there is a uh, real clinical research. And then out here in the marketplace, the anecdotal stories are just overwhelming. You're going to see some pictures of people that have got six pack abs showing again. And you're going to see some that have lost over 200 pounds. But we eat when we're hungry. We don't have to count calories. Just stick this list on your refrigerator. Eat from it. We have all kinds of recipe books. We make life really, really simple. And Fred, you're with us. And, and your journey began before the drops arrived. But you had a scare with cancer and basically went to our approved food list and have now incorporated the skinny drops in. But I think you're about 100 pounds down from your peak. Yes, sir. In fact, I'm, uh, that picture to the left, I believe I was 50 and uh, in the 50s. And, but uh, I'm currently 67. I'm in the best physical, spiritual and physical health I've been in a long, long time. The drops have worked. I've lost recently an additional eight pounds. Uh, because I really got after the, the eating properly and, and, and really stick it to the drops. They're an amazing product. And you'll see different body types here as we're talking. Uh, Kristen is a fitness girl. Kristen, you're with us too. Um, I know that you said that you've got your ideal body now, but you still take them because of the way it makes you feel. And don't forget you got to mute. There we go. Okay. Yeah. Let me know again. Yeah. Um, so I obviously, I use the drops now, not necessarily for weight loss. I use them for that hormone balance and the mood stability, but I do cycle them in um, a few times a year when I want to just get off that extra layer. So I always put them in in January and right before um, bathing suit season, because if you just put them in and you start eating from that uh, approved food list, you always end up losing a few extra pounds. But I do allude them to the happy drops because they completely now keep my hormones stable and my mood very even. So my husband likes them too because <clears throat> I'm a little easier to live with. <laughs> so Chris, I'm going to come back to you in just a second on our other product too. You, um, okay. All of us husbands love sure. our wives taking the, taking the happy drops. So Misty, uh, you, you, uh, I think your husband has told you, you can't lose any more weight. You've lost so much. Don't forget to unmute, Missy. Okay, we'll come back to Missy. So, at Missy, you can see what she did with her stomach there. It's quite remarkable. Go ahead, Missy. Okay. So this is Terry and Nancy. You can see both of them lost right at 50 pounds a piece. Uh, David and Dina now have got to update their slides. I want to say they're approaching 100 pounds combined now. Ursula, six children. She's now lighter than her first child. Uh, Kim Gray, she has muscular dystrophy, paralyzed from the waist down. Nothing had ever worked for her. And along came the drops, and she's down almost 100 pounds now. And then, Ernest, you're also a retired, uh, I, believe, I believe it was Lieutenant Colonel out of the Army. You can correct me if I'm wrong, but but uh, you're doing this in your retirement, and you've lost 42 pounds. Can you hear me? We got you, Ernest. Oh, hey, let me tell you, I, uh, I am a 20-year retired military officer, 
And uh, this uh, company has been incredible for me. Uh, I initially got into it for my health, but I think Nikki and Andrew, they all hit the nail on the head when they start talking about generational income. And for me, it has added another source of, of income that uh, allowed me free time to travel and do some of the things that I want to do, even though I don't do a lot of traveling. But more importantly, it has gotten my whole family involved, my daughter and my grandkids. For once in my life, I have to shut up and listen to them because they are doing it much more effectively with the, uh, you know, in the social environment in terms of the social media. And that's something I've never been involved with, with the Facebook. I just got one about a month ago, and it's been incredible in terms of like Nikki said, being able to reach out to friends of mine that I haven't heard from in 40 years at different installations that have retired. And I'm just enjoying it. And one of the most incredible thing is, I really do believe that I am developing some lifetime, you know, friends that's gonna last a lifetime because I don't ever plan to retire from this. And how I, much better is your health, Ernest? Well, <clears throat> Initially, I got COVID back there when, you know, and gained a whole lot of weight, and I couldn't lose the weight even though I was working, you know, five or six hours on the tennis court until Sanja Enfinger told me about this stuff called Skinner Drops, and I took it, and and it got the job done for me. In less than eight weeks, I had lost about 48 pounds, and so I lost the weight. But then I still had all kind of inflammation because I got a four inch roid in my back, had a total knee replacement and had all kind of surgery as an armor ranger. And I was just a walking guy with a lot of inflammation and my ankle would swell up from time to time. And I would do the traditional thing of elevate it and ice it down overnight. A couple of days later, I was ready to go. But I called Kim. Kim told me to take three, four of those moors that's primarily get rid of inflammation. And overnight, within 24 hours, I was back on the tennis court. So I will never stop taking the skin drops, even though I've taken it, stopped taking it now because I'm almost back at my fighting weight. But the inflammation is gone. But the one that really helped me get back in the game was the Renew. The Renew gave me my muscle tone back. It gave me my hair back. Believe it or not, I was going bald in the top. But thanks to Renew, I am back in the game on and off the tennis court. And those three products that I can personally testify that have completely transformed my life and just did wonders for my kids too because all of them are taking one or more of these products. Thank you, Ernest. And that's a perfect lead in to our second and third product, which we're briefly going to hit, then get to the end and go to Tim Sales. But but he mentioned Renew. It's one of our newer products. We have an international patent on it. And through four different pathways, it helps our body naturally make more human growth hormone, which is known in the medical world as the longevity hormone. It's a part of all cellular regeneration. So the higher levels we have of it, the better our body composition is going to be overall, the better our bone density, the better, really the better of our overall quality of life. Uh, increased lean muscle mass, lower bad cholesterol. And then there's a lot of studies coming out now, and you can look these up yourself on Google, that higher HGH levels correlate to less cardiovascular events and less cognitive decline. It's a part of all cellular regeneration, so really any tissue growth. So for women, prettier skin, prettier hair, prettier nails. And um, a lot of the new research showing higher HGH levels correlate to optimizing your pre uh, progesterone and your estrogen. So just a great, great product. And then our last and final product that we'll mention, a lot of people's favorite long-term, is our 36 superfood drink called MOA. It stands for Mother of All. Most of you will recognize the superfoods to include our six medicinal mushrooms that are in it that people are now chasing all around the world for their immune system bo boosting benefits. You can look them up on PubMed. The research is just overwhelming. But the number one reason MOA became so popular is exactly what Ernest just said. It doesn't matter what type of inflammation is in your body. 
it's going to be reduced. So this was a type 2 diabetic with swollen ankles. Two weeks in on the skinny drops in MOA. You just heard Ernest. He took three MOA before he went to bed. That was the next morning. This is eczema and psoriasis. It dries up almost 100% of the time. This gentleman's 53, had been on medication since he was a kid. This is rheumatoid arthritis. Uh, Miss Deborah uh, got on three a day. Her swelling in her thighs came out in 20 days. You see that picture there. She was on a walker in the left picture. Four months later, she's back to normal. You can see her there in the right-hand picture. Uh, Willie, professional football player with torn up shoulders, had been on prescription meds to sleep. Within a week, came off his medications, was able to sleep throughout the night. And we have it in all kind of high schools and with top athletes from around the world. And Kristen, you're, I believe, 38, 39 now. And this was an unsolicited text from you one day. And I asked, could I put it on the PowerPoint? You were kind enough to say yes. But you feel like the MOA and the Renew have really exposed your abs. And um, you always work out. I mean, you own a CrossFit gym, but it's still hard to get them to show. You want to share that in conclusion? Yeah, sure. So I will be 39 in February. And yes, I have, um, I was involved in high school sports I've trained, um, I've been a fitness instructor since I was 19. So I've been in the fitness industry now for almost 20 years. So <laughs> there should be no reason I didn't have abs. The problem is I could never get them unless I was trying to do a figure competition, which I did in my early 20s. And then as soon as the, sh the figure show was over, I'd go back to eating and then I'd fluff right back up. Um, and that's kind of how it went. And then I started training, training, trying to dial into my nutrition, but I would, you know, I'd be in shape, but I could never get um, my abs to pop. Why did I want them to pop? I don't know. It just was, you know, a goal of mine. I finally gave up on that goal a couple of years ago. And then I got my hands on Renew in October 2021. And they naturally just started coming out on their own um, about this year. And so I really attribute it to um, the HGH levels changing. It's kind of just like... Um, that little secret weapon, I think that changed with your um, nutrient absorption, the way your body synthesizes nutrition, proteins. And then of course, when you add MOA in and you have the inflammation staying off, there's no water weight to hold. So they just pop. Um, so again, yeah, I sent that as a being proud of myself to Todd, but when he asked if he could share it, I was totally fine for someone to brag on it a little bit. I don't know how long I can keep them on through the holidays, but I'm going to try because I do have drops that I started again. Um, but those are hands down my two favorite products that we offer. So in conclusion, let's go back to where we started because this is a home-based business or what we call a global virtual franchise. You can now work it whether you're home or not, from your phone or your iPad or your computer. But you pay $29.95 one time. You buy your global virtual franchise. You're in business. You're 1099 don't earnings. You've got all the tax benefits of a small business owner. We need to qualify your business with an initial order of 200 points. This is one of the favorite packs people use. They buy four boxes of drops. They sell three at retail, and they get almost $500 back in return for selling their three. So they've got all of their money back for their business and they get to use their box of drops for free. And if you want some personal consumption packs, you can get two boxes of Cinderized and two boxes of the superfoods. And if weight loss is not a goal, get your superfoods and HGH product. But those are three great starter packs. You can quickly upgrade to some 10 packs and possibly even some great big packs to get tremendous discounts and great profitability if you decide to retail some. You'll, you will need to get your full 30% discount and to get paid on Friday, you'll need one customer a month. It can be you called a subscribe and save of 100 points or $150. Remember, we have 100 products. So this is interchangeable. Every month, I call it redirected spending. This vitamin and mineral, the omega-3, the CoQ10, all the things you're already taking, you'll now be able to get it, do it through yourself. Higher quality products, our vitamin and mineral, our vitamin C, our grapeseed extract are all in the physician desk reps. They're literally some of the best in the world. And when you get all that done, your $29.95, your initial order, and your auto ship, you've got your global virtual franchise. You're going to be paid here nine different ways. You'll get your paychecks every Friday. The only way we'll talk about today is when you get started, our job is to sell product. As you just saw, we're going to find some people that maybe want to buy our product, make a retail profit. 
And then the second thing we're going to do is look for some other people that might be want to be a global virtual franchise owner with us. Maybe some other veterans or even active duty people that are looking to retire. Their spouses are looking for something to do. You can find as many people that want to pay $29.95 and be a brand partner as you want to. Our model calls for finding two. And we're going to help them get two. And all of a sudden, we're going to build a big distribution network out. And our goal is to get what we call your base pay to $250 per week. Because when we do, the company is going to start setting aside an extra 15% into a savings account for you. And when that savings account hits $10,000, which you'll be able to see it grow on real time every time you log in, you'll get a congratulatory call. But more importantly, that particular week, you'll get an extra $10,000 direct deposited into your bank account. And then from that point forward, you'll be able to just draw that out. Every single, and by the way, there's another uh, veteran, uh, uh, Gracie and Benny are retired pastors, but Benny was also a chaplain in the Navy for many, many years. Their son is a career chaplain in the Navy. So more veterans work in the business and they do extremely well. They have totally built their retirement here, probably in the neighborhood of about 3000 a week that they've now built over the course of several years. And there's all kind of free vacations you can win from Tahiti to the Bahamas. They're both running right now, but Fred, I'm going to turn it over to you guys. I'm going to go into the background, turn my camera off. But Tim Sells, while he was a, a uh, Navy SEAL, which in the military world, we always call that the top of the pinnacle. If you can become a Navy SEAL, you're considered to be the toughest in the military. Very hard to get in that club. But Tim did it. And when Tim realized he was going to be getting out of the military, got involved in our industry. And he's become not only a great networker, but he's become a tremendous advocate for our industry. If you've not seen a lot of his videos that are online talking about this is the greatest industry in the world and combating some of the negative things, connotations that people have out there, he's one of the best out there there's ever been. So, Tim and Fred, I'm going to turn it back to you guys and let y'all two close this out tonight. Yes, sir. First of all, I wanted to let you know I can't uh, seem for whatever my uh, camera's frozen, but it looks like it is anyway. But, hey, that's the way it goes. Here's <clears throat> this is the way the meeting is going sideways here. Are we still all on? There we go. And uh, so I want to make sure everybody understands we got one of the most special men in this industry and his wife as well. But Tim Sales is a Navy SEAL. He, he's he been with us for golly knows how long he's been in this industry. He'll tell his own story. But I will say this. I wish that my camera's working. Looks like the moment it's supposed to work, it won't work for whatever reason. But the holding in my hand called the professional inviter. I've never been on Mr. Sales' uh, particular organization or team. And all these years, but I am now, but here's what I do know. He's made me an absolute fortune and he's never known me up until recently. So Mr. Sales, a veteran, uh, we just want to invite you to share your story. And uh, man, we're just excited about having you here, sir. Uh, Fred, you're really nice, sir. Can you hear me? I can. Thank you very much for your, uh, your introduction. Um, and all I thought, as soon as you said that your camera wasn't coming on is Murphy's law. Um, yes. There's a phrase that we have in special operations is uh, Murphy's law is always gets a vote. Okay. So Murphy gets a vote. And so it doesn't matter if our engine falls off the back of our boat. It doesn't matter, you know, whatever it is, you know, every time we're jumping out of airplanes or whatever, it's always Murphy's law. Murphy's hanging around. He gets a vote. So uh, thank you for just rolling with the whole conversation. Um, I am so, so very impressed uh, with all of the, the results that I see coming out of this team. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what else you could watch that this many people are having such tremendous success with their health, uh, with earning money. Um, so just to kind of roll back a few years, I grew up in a, a small town in Tennessee and um, I was pretty much the dumbest person at Hickson High School, I'm sure, uh, and, and middle school. Um, I don't know. I just, did, I just didn't get into school. I just didn't, it didn't make sense to me why I couldn't just fish every day. And so when it came time where everybody was asking me what I was going to do with my life and what I was going to be, I, I was just kind of shrugged my shoulders. I'm, I don't know. Um, and uh, a, a guy walks by in the Cracker Jack uniform. And, uh, and I walked past him. And I just stared at him as he went by. He had ribbons on. 
he had taps on his Short shoes video. and he was clicking and uh you know and and i was just in awe as he went by and so i ran past him turned to left went through the cafeteria ran that way came back out the other way to walk by him again and so uh when i was walking by it was like he had deja vu he was like <laughs> and uh and i just stopped him i go what do you do and he says i'm a i'm a navy recruiter and i said do you have underwater welding he goes we do and I said, how much does it cost? Because I had already wanted to do that. That was what I wanted to be. And so he said, it's free, son. All you have to do is just spend some time in the military. I said, how long? He said, four years. And I get to learn how to weld underwater? Yes. So that was it for me. 17 years old, I went in the military. Uh, I had a hard time, though, because I, I just really, you know, when I said I didn't do well in school, there was, I, I literally made lower than F grades. Okay. Because so an F was fail, but that was a 64 percentage. Uh, well, I was down in the twenties. And so I call it an F minus minus, uh, because I just couldn't figure it out. I, I didn't know how to spell being in Tennessee. You can't pronounce words as the way other people do. <laughs> and uh, and I guess I just couldn't. And I would dot my I's. I would uh, dot in the middle between E and I because I didn't know if it was E before I or I before E. Just that, that kind of stuff. I was always trying to cover how dumb I was. And, uh, and when I got in the Navy and went into special operations, they did something that was different. And, uh, and what they did is that they, they drilled you until you couldn't do it wrong. And... And that was my holy grail. And because once I could figure that out, then I learned how to jump out of airplanes from helicopters, from aircrafts, from all different kinds of aircrafts. Uh, I was able to defuse bombs. That was my specialty in special operations was uh, EOD, Explosive Ordnance Disposal. So I would defuse bombs underwater and all these kind of things. And so, um, you know, like a lot of people praise, just like Todd said, uh, but in in my way of looking at it all i wanted to do was to serve my country to the highest level that i possibly could and i've heard some some incredible people here majors and and you know like you know kids of you know big professional people in the military and and so i'm just so honored and you know i did have tears in my eyes i don't know if you see that i didn't set that up for you guys uh, that is my office that is where i live and so I've got a little parachute guy there and freedom is in the center there, a deep sea diving helmet. Um, because really and truly, when I was in the military, there came a time when I said, I'm done. And that time was when I realized that I wanted to have a spouse. And so, Todd, my story really is a is a love story because I was sitting there trying to negotiate all of the problems that I had, right? So I wanted to get out of the military because I was kicking in doors, going in, everybody shooting at me, me shooting at everybody else. And no wife wants a guy like that, right? I was gone. Sometimes I'd be gone for six months, a year, two years. I couldn't tell them where I was going and all of this. And so that was not the way I kind of pictured uh, my life with a spouse, right? And so that was really the kicker that I that caused me to start looking to say, OK, so how do I do this? I don't want to come home, uh, kiss my wife, uh, spend two hours together and go to bed and then get up and kiss each other and not see each other all day. That's not what I, I was. I wanted a dream girl. Right. My, my dream girl. And uh, and so what? what kind of life was that? I didn't want that. And so I tried to figure out all these different ways. And I ran across network marketing, answered an ad in the newspaper that nobody would have answered except me, because I thought the guy was being arrogant. And I thought, who's this guy I think he is, you know, I want to meet this guy, you know, and so it was like earn $20,000 a month in six to 24 months or something like that. And I was like, man, he's cocky. I want to, I want to like, I'm going to go chin to chin to him with, with him. And so that that guy ended up saving, changing my whole life. So I've had a six to seven figure income for the last 34 years of my life. And so the testimonials 
that you're going to see and and probably have seen for those of you who have been on there's gals and and guys jumping into this thing and they're like making a thousand bucks in the first week they're making like ridiculous and i and i'm just like i'm sitting over here and i'm just smiling and i'm i just praise all of you for your energy and your inner you know your your whole like intention to uh to help people lose weight like i i lost uh 26.7 pounds 60 days and i thought uh, i'm an anomaly and so i got 24 guys during an ad on facebook and uh and they they lost no, I lost 28 pounds. They lost 26.7 pounds. And so I was like, this thing is so dialed in, you know, like that's ridiculous. No doctor's office can can claim that they can, they, that what their average is. They'll never tell you what the average is and stuff like that. So the, the products are rock solid. It's an honor for me to go out bound and find people who want to lose weight, uh, get healthier, you know, uh, you know, my, my, uh, my whole life is centered around helping people. And I don't know if anybody else has the same opinion of me, but this is just the way I view it. That So I went abroad to uh, suppress terrorism that's coming to the United States. So that was kind of the, I don't know, the sales pitch that I got. And when you know I get over there, you know, I'm over there and I'm fighting, I'm doing all these different things. And and then when I come back home and I'm out of the military, I look around and I say, you know what? The biggest problem that we have in America is not terrorism. Um, it's the degradation of the human body. Like, you know, like you, you can just see it when you look at people maybe 50 years ago, 100 years ago, and you see these streets of people and they're all lean and, you know, like all these different things. So something is attacking us within our own country. And so I thought there's not a better way than to help people to get their bodies back and as well as have our income uh, source that does life, does last a lifetime. So if anybody tells you that this isn't quote, stable, I'd said six to seven figure incomes for 34 years. So, and uh, most of those are in high uh, six figure incomes and seven figure incomes. So it's very stable. I do spend a lot of time. Network Marketing Power is the channel on YouTube where I just basically, I'm just an analyst. I just analyze and I compare all other industries to network marketing. I'll give you a quote here that, uh, so, it's um, like, I think it's 13 or 16 times more people will make $100,000 in network marketing, this company, uh, compared to real estate agents. Now, why don't you hear that anywhere? It's We're not attacked because we're bad. We're attacked because we're better. And if anybody ever knew that if I got a job at Procter & Gamble, they're going to put me under an employment contract. That contract is devils in the details. And what, it, what I mean by that is, is that they make about $9 billion a year in profit simply because of one simple thing. They, they, they pay you a salary and you think that's good, but they get the residual income of all of the sales reps acquisitions. And so you might get a bonus for an acquisition, but you don't get the lifetime value out of the customers that all those sales reps get. The fact that you can go out and build uh, 10 customers, 100 customers, 1,000 customers, and then when you get a team or something like that, you know, you're talking about tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands, and you're getting a small royalty, and it's a residual thing. You get it for the life of the customer. As long as that customer is a customer, you get it for the life. And that is the reason that pe that, that, that FTC or uh, people, they're attacking it simply because it's so much superior to any other industry. So I just wanted to just share that, that part with you. And Fred, if you got any questions for me or Todd, anybody, you know, I, I'm just honored to be here and, and just couldn't think of a better way to, to, hey, uh, Tim. Tim, to Mrs. Tim, yes, Tim, sir. 
This is Ken Bailey. First of all, I want to thank you for your service. And as we close out, Tim, of all the thousands of companies in our industry, you chose Partner Co. Can you just close out by maybe telling us why you chose this company? Um, yeah. So the glory is in the details also. So if you uh if you're able to to really understand what uh so somebody asked me, why aren't you on why what's that? And I said, Well, did you read their policies and procedures? And uh and people are like, no. And I go, well, they can go into your network and download anything that you have on any of your networks that you're connected to, and they can use it. They it's their own property. So I'm going to get to somewhere with this. What I have to mean is, is that I look at the policies and procedures, right? I look at the compensation plan. I know exactly how they pay out and how most companies are going to uh, retain uh, and make it very, very, very difficult for a person to get to a higher level in the comp plan. And so, uh, so, so that they can get more profits. And this company didn't do that. All right. It, they didn't do that. So they just did it in the most fair way that is, you know, and it's so ethical. And so you look at the compensation plan, then you're going to find that it is the highest paying out compensation plan that has lasted. Some people can start a company and six months later, they're gone because they paid out too much, but this is the highest paying one. Um, and that's on the compensation plan. On the product quality side, that's a real superior thing for me because um, I've been in two companies. This is my second company. And, and, uh, and when I found out that there was a harmful ingredient in a product, I dismissed without sorrow. I just dismissed. I'm not going to promote something that's going to harm somebody. And so uh, I, uh, I was uh, very curious to uh, go outbound and find the people who had the ethics along with being willing to give us a good comp plan. So um, the product quality, I've never seen anything better than that. And then the, the bill of rights is something that, that they, uh, they have. And the bill of rights is something where you look at it and you say, okay, so what do other network marketing companies do? And you can just kind of look at it where there's a piece of paper there that's a contract between you and the company. And that contract is their, their pitch. That's their opportunity. That's what, that's what you're, they're trying to get you to sign. And so I look around and I study. I study what you, rights that you actually have in the company. And so uh, you can look at a lot of them and you won't believe you know, like there's some network marketing companies that say you own nothing. All right. This company says you own all <laughs> like that was just fundamental. And so I there's just not a, a better company. And, and I'm not, you know, new. I taught at the University of Illinois at Chicago. I was uh, interviewed by Do uh, Larry King uh, from CNN having to do with uh, Ponzi scam scams, pyramid schemes and, and legitimate network marketing. I've been all over the world teaching at uh, various different universities. So I know the industry probably as well as anybody does. And so partner goes it, man. Well said, buddy. When you got protection like that, the best products in the world and the best compensation plan. But thank you so much, Fred. You want to close us out there, buddy? Yes, sir. Just want to say thank you again, Mr. Sales and everybody who was on the Zoom tonight. We appreciate our veterans. Uh, my heart goes out. I wish my cam was working. Mr. Sales, can I ask one quick question? I know we're running along. It's one thing that you've made six figures, seven figures. How many people do you think you've helped, say, hit six figures or better? Well, I know in our first seven years, uh, I had $57 uh, million earners and 5,201, I think, that earned a quarter million dollars. Well, thank you. That's just I, I challenge you to go to any other company and ask them that question. I don't care if it's Microsoft. I don't care if it's Apple. I don't care who it is. Man, so that says you're such a leader and such a giver. We appreciate you more than you know, because I know your time's very valuable. In fact, he gave up. Uh, he's supposed to be cooking for his sons. 
and he was with us tonight. So we appreciate that, sir. Like I can't believe. God bless everybody and good night. Okay. Thank you all. You're incredible. God bless you. Thank you, Chuck. Good night. Thanks, everybody. Thanks, everybody. Thanks so much.